Hey! So this will be the third and final video of my talent trip series because I have a few other videos and projects I want to work on. But if you'd like to see my first and second videos on transportation food, you can click over here. The annotations are here. If you're a tablet and phone user, I'll put links in the description below. But okay, so this is Shilling Market at noon or morning or so. And it's all groceries, vegetables, food, meat, seafood, all that type of stuff. It's a little chaotic because people are yelling their different prices and trying to get different customers and sometimes cars or motorcycles just come down this middle of the road. And then you're just paranoid you're gonna get burnt by their exposed exhaust pipes, so it's a little all crazy. <laughs> you don't have laminated price tags you get at like the supermarket. You just have cardboard and like a number scribble on it, or you just ask the people themselves and you trust that they give you the right number. But fast forwarding a few hours and this whole place transforms into the Shilling Night Market. Shilling Night Market is actually one of the biggest night markets in Taipei, one of the most popular, one of the most famous. So many different types of food. At this one stationary shop, there's just like hundreds of just pens. And then there's all these different types of clothes and everything, you just twist so many people. And remember this green sheet over here? This green sheet over here was the same green sheet at the market. So everything just transforms, it's crazy. Everything has to be completely moved because the crazy thing is they do this each night. So everything has to be easy to move. Everything to be put back, and it's pretty insane how they transfer so many things like so quickly. This is a little different underground malls. In the Taipei subway system, in the very center is a station called Taipei Main Station. I know, really creative. The subway tracks are already underground, and then between the subway tracks and the ground level is an underground mall that touches other stations, so it's pretty big. And it's just like clothes, accessories, jewelry. Obviously, can't have food very much. Otherwise, the smells all get trapped. Moving to the ground floor is the train station of the subway station. The train station is literally trains that like go across the island and everything. And then the, the second floor of the train station is like this rectangle of just like restaurants that overlook the center of the building. And this is Shimanding, a really popular, really famous shopping district in Taipei. It's not considered night market because it's also open during the day. Actually, according to Wikipedia, Shimanding is actually the source of a lot of the fashion in Taiwan. It's also a really famous fashion district. You don't see as much food as you would in the night market. It's mostly all stores built into buildings and you see vendors here and there. It's all pedestrian, there's lights everywhere, it's all really loud. So it's really like a Taiwan Times Square. Near one of the entrances to Ximending was this really talented spray paint artist who uses like really simple objects like the edge of a cylinder or something. You just like spray a little, do something over here, and you make this like really elaborate painting in just like less than five minutes. This is a really short clip, but I did get the full recording of a, one of his paintings from start to finish. This is a little bit of like four minutes or so. If you'd like to see that, you can click over here or I'll also put a link in the description. And then here are some more artists. This artist makes like art using like calligraphy, English letters. This person carves her face into like plastic and makes a bobblehead. Away from the intense nightlife of Ximending or like the night markets and everything, this is just a typical indoor market. The reason why I wanted to end on this one was because when I was about to exit, saw this really hilarious eel, really enthusiastic, and you just really want to be on footage, so here you go. But there you have it, transportation, food, shopping, hopefully you liked it. I do plan on releasing another sketch sometime at the end of September or so, but I also plan on doing like 25 facts about me video. So leave in the comments below if you want me to do any specific videos, like any tagged videos, like uh, toilet tag if you've seen any of those on YouTube or draw my life or if you want me to do like challenges reaction videos I'll be happy to do that just leave them down in the comments below so I can see them yes I would love it if you can give this a thumbs up if you like this video I will see you soon bye